Scores of people are missing after a dam burst in eastern Sudan, unleashing surging waters that wiped out at least 20 villages, according to the United Nations. One first responder said that between 150 and 200 people were unaccounted for. Officials said the dam had started crumbling and silt had been building during days of heavy rain that had come much earlier than usual. Here is UN spokesperson Stéphane Dujaric. The Arba'at Dam is a crucial facility in Port Sudan, serving as a primary source of fresh water for the city. The reported damage is expected to have a substantial impact on water supplies to Port Sudan, worsening the humanitarian situation. On the road to Arba'at on Monday, a Reuters reporter saw people burying a man and covering his grave with driftwood to try and prevent it from being washed away in mudslides. The homes of about 50,000 people were impacted by the flooding, the United Nations said, citing local authorities. It added that the number only accounted for the area west of the dam, as the area east was inaccessible. The dam was the main source of water for Port Sudan. The city is home to the country's main Red Sea port and airport and receives most of the country's much-needed aid deliveries. Sudan's dams, roads and bridges were already in disrepair before the war between the Sudanese army and the paramilitary rapid forces began in April 2023. Both sides have since funneled the bulk of their resources into the conflict, leaving infrastructure badly neglected.